when the camera's pointed at her, oh my goodness, she shouts uncontrollably. Whenever we have family parties and we're clapping, she makes it about herself. Uki starts singing and shouting and shifting from side to side. <laughs> if I compliment her, she jumps up and down. I love you. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I'm surprised the neighbors haven't complained yet. Wow. Oh my goodness. The more you compliment her, the happier she is. But for a long time. She was reserved and shut down. Prior to her, I had another golfing in Kaka too. He passed away. We were heartbroken. And my mechanic knew about it. And he said that he found this gorgeous little creature who was apparently being abused. She was being kept in a mechanic shop. Just saw her standing on this cage, uh, trembling away. That kind of like moved me emotionally. And that's how I got to meet her and take her home. We noticed that she was definitely very defensive when people try to pet her because the children at the house she lived were uh, physically pulling her tail feathers forcefully. At the time, she couldn't fly either. But in our home, we really, really show her a lot of love and affection. She was being fed properly and cared for properly. We do not like keeping her cage at all throughout the entire day. So with this new environment, she actually gained her ability to fly it again. And in three months or so, she started breaking out of her shell. Who's that? I often edit photos as part of my job, and I sit on the computer for hours at a time listening to music. And she started to burst out a little bit of sounds as she was making an attempt to sing. I was encouraging that behavior, so now she can never have enough. To get our attention, she wet herself so that my husband would have to pick her up and blow dry her. And if I compliment her, it's all about showing a lot of emotions. Her enjoying life, dancing to music, uh, shouting, as much as some people find it annoying, it's contagious for us. I don't understand why she does it, but I am forever grateful.